We are about 29 hours until our earliest opportunity to launch our space launch system and Orion spacecraft. You see them live there on Launchpad 39B here at Kennedy Space Center. When it launches, Artemis 1 will be humanity's return to the moon in almost 50 years. Good morning and welcome back for another live briefing of our Artemis 1 mission. I'm Megan Cruz and thank you uh, so much for being here with us today. This briefing is to update you all on how our countdown is going so far. As you know, the two-hour launch window opens tomorrow, September 3rd at 2.17 p.m. Eastern Time. Um, team is doing an absolutely tremendous job moving through launch countdown. And um, so yesterday at uh, 14.17 local time, we reset the clock to T-minus 45 hours and counting. And uh, so far, they're proceeding right on schedule. This is a test flight, right? And, and so while I feel very good about our procedures, when you look the team in the eye, they're ready. Uh, we can't control the weather. Um, and so on, on any given day, you know, th there is risk that we'll be able to get off. I think uh, what I kind of am looking at is our team is ready. They are getting better with every attempt and actually performed superbly um, during launch countdown number one. So in my mind, I think uh, if the conditions with weather and the hardware align, we will absolutely go. Um, and we have the right team at kind of the right time. So in those statistics, right, those probabilities go way up if we get two attempts off before the end of this window. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.